Let's have a point. Oh, you! Oh, yeah! A little louder, a little louder. Oh, you! Oh, yeah! This is fucking insane, guys. This is crazy. All right, let's give a big shout out to Cornell. Let's give it up for Cornell for letting us do this this year. Give it up. Also, give it up for our sponsor, Dr. Pizza. Be if you want some pizza. And Silver Serpent. Woo! This is DJ So what we got? Oh, no groovy. Yo, my name is DJ Hex, y'all know me. We're gonna shake up the vibe a little bit. We're gonna do a little bit of dub step. shut down I am working on um well I'm I'm trying to like do as little as possible let these guys do it if that right there is not the definition of insane mental craziness I don't know what is anyways on a real note that was absolutely crazy insane like I just said and um, it was estimated that about 3,000 people were there within the main console on the upper decks and inside the apartment so there's about 3,000 plus people at this year's Palmer place by far by far the biggest and the craziest amount that we've ever done if you guys have been following my channel for a while you know you've seen the last like three I think we've done or yeah the last three times we've done this you guys have seen um, this is the fourth time now that I've been involved in doing Palmer Place. And as you guys can go back and look every year, year after year after year, this thing has grown and got bigger and bigger and bigger every single time until this one, which is just absolutely insane. One new thing, and I'm actually kind of ticked off about it that it finally went through, but now the apartment complex is actually working with the DJs in terms of 
uh, they, they realize that we're a source of engagement and a source of crowd control in a way. We, we have mics, we have speakers, we can tell people what to do, where to do, inform them of the rules and keep the crowd uh, to a minimum. We're, we're entertainers, we know how to do that. So it's cool now that they're working with us. I wish they would have done this in the past because as you guys saw last year, I had to like fight to basically be able to set up. Um, but now they like work with us. They let us put up a stage this year. Not really a big stage, a little stage. But um, this just is like the tip of the iceberg for what we want to do next year. This was kind of like a little like last minute experiment. Kevin and Kaylin contacted me. Marcellus contacted me and said, "Hey, they gave us approval to do it like a month before this was going to happen. So this is like all we could come up with." Uh, with the sponsors, the amount of sponsorships that they were able to get in that short amount of time to pay for something of this size. So next year, hopefully if we can do this again and work with them, we'll plan out a lot more, get some legitimate barriers, get some legitimate sound system, and uh, do this correctly and properly. But yeah, I'm going to leave it at that. If you guys want to check out the list of all the gear and everything, it's in the comments uh, down below. And uh, if you like this crazy, epic uh, college gig log be sure to give it a big thumbs up if you're not already subscribed to this YouTube channel uh, Click that subscribe button so you can see all the amazing awesome variety of content. I'm posting here in terms of DJ industry DJing Madness also if you want to be a supporter of the channel and support the content and support all the things I'm doing on this channel link to the patreon down below in the description like always guys My name is DJ Rick Webb keep the record spinning and I will see you guys next time with another crazy awesome DJ event